Hello there and welcome back. Oh, I'm so looking forward to this. As soon as I saw my name in the schedule against this show, I started getting excited because it's been such a long, long time since I've worked with a lovely lady beside me. We're talking pearly winks. So, of course, we're talking ladies. So it's not any of the guys, is it? It's going to be our lovely Donna. Get yourself all dolled up in your fancy <laughs> apron there. How are you doing? I'm good. You good? I'm very well. Really pleased to be working with you. You too. And I'm pleased as well because you've bought some brand new things. I have that we haven't seen them. I say we haven't seen them before. We've seen them, but not in the colour combinations that we've got because we've got some brand new generations with regards to some of these items. And I've got the most incredible stencil as well. Love this. Is this one of your artwork pieces? It's actually Simon's. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, it's got a bit of an artistic <laughs> flair as it well. certainly is, yeah. Love it. Now have a look at this. It's a good size, good size um, stencil that we're looking at here. It's A4, a beautiful feather. I love the way he's captured. You can see their hope, love and peace featuring within the actual stencil itself there. You've also got your additional elements there. So you have got the beautiful sentiment there. Believe in your dreams and follow your heart. Isn't that good advice? Now, 10% of the stock has already gone of these. Obviously, as you would expect, when you're working with anything from Pearly Winks, you know that you've got quality. You know you, you've got that Christmas, that clean look with these. But then, of course, you've got the creativity because they bring us such a wonderful range of products that are going to work alongside these stencil. So, 12 dollars I mean, this, I love this layout that we've got here, Donna, that gorgeous purple. Thank you. Does look amazing? <laughs> I'd love to take the um, compliment, but it's obviously Simon's colours. Yeah. Oh, I love it though. But it just comes together so beautifully. I love purple. This one here, it's a nice idea because it's kind of taking advantage of almost like a rainbow colour going across there with the sentiment. Yeah, it is really. You can really change it up and, you know, mix it about. It's love good. It. And of course, with stencils, you can use them with things like your paints, or maybe you're going to be using them with your texture mediums. Because with this one, this one's a canvas, um, I think you can just about see there how you have got the raised effect. Now, with this particular stone, my goodness, already, if I've just shown it to you, for goodness sake, 20% of the stock has gone already. It's proven to be a popular one. Oh, fantastic. I think people have been looking forward to this. They have indeed. Um, now, <laughs> I will just very give you, give you a quick little nod to some of the elements that you've got in here. You've got some copper infusions featuring within these now we did see the infusions previously we've actually got a second generation so another a range of colors coming with those so if you did get the first set you might want to jump ahead and have a little look of those gorgeous copper infusions some beautiful colors in there um, and again there you go you can see some of them being used in here and you can see that little shimmer there that's where that gorgeous infusion is coming through. This is a lovely, lovely stencil, and you are loving it. A quarter of the stock has gone now. So here you go. You can see this lovely little card here. And again, oh, I don't, I don't want to undo it because oh, it's such a pretty little bird. Oh, there's nothing in there. Yeah, please oh, don't no. open it. Oh, I'll, I'll do it. I'll fix it. Don't worry, I'll fix it. Sorry, you weren't quick enough. <laughs> we'll sort that out. Oh, this is a nice one as well. Look at that. Isn't that effective? Love it. So 631476 is your all important item number. £12.99. All created from that one stencil. And this is the beauty. You're going to be able to use this in so many different ways. The smaller feather there used in that last card. But look at this. I mean, things for like your wall art. If you're wanting to create home decor pieces to go into picture frames, use your fabric paints with these. Get them onto your cushions, your home decor. It is an absolutely amazing stencil and you are loving it. 631476 six if you're wanting to get hold of those please 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 do take advantage of it add them into your basket absolutely amazing as you can see there and i've got just love that rainbow of colors that we've got there down at the front as well have you checked out these finished samples that we've got at the front as well we've got some amazing effects again canvases um, it's a big size stencil you can see here from this gorgeous feather that i'm holding here as well a really large size and look within the design as well this is the key thing you've got different elements so you don't have to use it in its entirety you could just use that little segment there maybe you might just want a sunrise on a project maybe you might just want those little swirls that you've got there maybe just using the word peace or hope or love all of those featuring within there and then of course you have got those little elements there like your dream catcher featuring there coming right the way through it's a big size stencil just 12 pounds and 99 pence 631476 is that all important item but if you'd like to take advantage of that you're going to have to be quick though because lots of you are adding it into your basket now those copper infusions let me tempt you with these these are amazing wait till you see these now 
If you've invested in these before, you will know just how incredible these are. But have a look at the colours that we've got on the canvas here. The beauty is that you've got that gorgeous copper infusion, which is giving you that little metallic, metallic little shimmer, that, as you can see there, um, coming through. In fact, can I take it off the little easel there? Because I'm frightened of taking it because it might fall off, you see, because it's kind of teetering on the edge. But I think it's important that we give it a, give it a good showbiz wiggle. Let's move that out of the way. Showbiz wiggle. <laughs> <laughs> so as you can see there, that's where you've got that content. That copper infusion, Donna, I mean, with this, absolutely beautiful. It really, really is. It's been so popular. Um, we've obviously brought out these new colours, but I think it's all out three times, the time yeah. before. Yeah, oh, right. Yeah, Gosh. the first generation, so... That's it. Now, we're talking about second generation, so we've got more colours to share with you on these ones, including some beautiful, beautiful colours. So the bundle down at the front there, um, we will see Donna working with these in a few months. I'm going to pop that back in place um, so as you can see that. But over a quarter of the stock has gone. Now, the key thing with these, and I will show you this before we go over to Donna, because this is something that will show you the quality, because you are getting so much of that gorgeous um, element in there. So I'm going to pick this one up to show you. Now, this one here, what colour is this one? That we've got here this one is antique okay now when you look at your spray bottle you can see you've got a lot of content within that spray bottle a little really will go a long way but let me turn it around can you see all of that within there now donna when we get these home which is the best way to actually mix these do we give them a shake do we roll them if you can give them a swirl a swirl like a, a little swirl yeah. like that okay. yeah just so it all mixes um obviously we do tra transport them and stuff like that so sometimes it does go up the tube but you know you're paying for them you want to look after them so yes. just to be on the air of caution really there. absolutely gorgeous so give it a good swirl good swirl and then you start spritzing them and you start spraying with them and you get some amazing results have a look at this one liz has been using them here with those sprays as you can see they're adding that shimmer and that shine absolutely beautiful coming through now with these you don't have to choose you're going to get all six of those so if you've got the previous bundle don't worry you're going to get all of these so you've got all your different colors including your anemone blue including your chartreuse um, yellow you're also going to get that fabulous antique as well and there you can see the texture so this is using the stencil again there so the stencil giving you the texture with your mediums in there but then of course you can be using that fabulous spray on top there to give you that gorgeous look right the way through even going on to your mdf i mean have a look at this will this have gone straight on to mdf then donna with this one yep you can put it straight onto mdf especially with the copper infusions yes um some of the some people like to put the coat on first of gesso or something like that yeah. but you know. well, I suppose with MDF because it, it draws it in doesn't yeah. it so it, it might be more economical because you want to keep the good stuff don't you yeah. so use your gesso <laughs> and then go over the top with the good stuff that's the key thing don't use any more than you need to but you'll still get that wonderful effect and there you go you can see there it's almost like a um, running through you know like when you see those gorgeous kind of um, semi-precious um, stones and things like that where you've got all those gorgeous colors thinking about like lapis lazuli and all those kind of different colors. I don't know if that's the right word but you know what I mean you get that gorgeous kind of infusion running through now I'm gonna pop the copper back there because of course you are going to get all six of these and I don't want you to think I'm shortchanging it so you're going to get all of those gorgeous colours coming to you for just £17.99 if you fancy them 317251 just £17.99 but then about what about your vibes now I'm sure you will have been introduced to wink vibes previously but these are a beautiful beautiful little spray again and again second generation so it's the second time that we've seen these but these are brand new colors so with regards to these ones again you've got a lot of content within this set each one of those bottles is 30 mil um, and you've got a high concentration of colour within each one of these. So it's one of those ones that less is more, again, because of the concentration that you've got in here, a little bit really, really does go a long way. Let's have a look at some of those gorgeous finished samples. I love that stencil being used there, but have a look at this. Painting with them, maybe, as you can see there. Picking out those colours. Again, stamping, colouring in creating your backgrounds here you go um, Cheryl was working with the um, anemone blue and the blue grotto with this particular one so again there absolutely incredible re results there Leanne here has been using the second generation vibes in her example here love this oh the pull that <gasps> dream big and conquer and there he is and his little conquers oh I love it 
Um, here you go, what else have we got here? Simon, oh Simon you've been busy, I like this one. The background's been created using the magenta and the, the blue grotto and the chart chartreuse um, yellow. Isn't that a beauty? I love that shimmer and sparkle there. So whether you're going for the wink vibes by themselves or whether you're going to use them alongside your copper infusions, you are going to get some lovely results. Intense colours, more pastel tones. You can be able to use them right the way throughout. So £14.99. 541697 is that item number if you're wanting to get hold of those. A lot within each of those bot um, bottles are going to go a long, long way. Now, your winky inkies, have a look at these. Now, this is really clever because you're going to get um, all of the bottles that you're seeing here. So you're going to get your four winky inkies and you're going to get your magic drops as well. Now, magic drops, tell me about magic drops, Donna. I'm going to get hold of the bottle here and bring it up so we can have a closer look. What is this all about then? So they help to blend and extend. I'm going to be using them in a minute with the Winky Inkies. Um, they also act as a resist as well. Oh, OK. So um, a, couple of few, a couple of different things you can do with it, but um, they're really, really good for blending. Lovely. Looking forward to seeing those in action. So you're going to get that. That's kind of like your magic ingredient that's going to come alongside these. And here you go. You can see all your fabulous bottles featuring there. And again, loads of examples using those winky inkies there. Um, so £14.95 being your price, 480099. And again, have a little look. That stencil coming back again. Stencil again, it's still flying out. Um, so, again, if you're wanting it, £12.99. Do not miss out on it as well. So, absolutely beautiful, as you can see there. Oh, my goodness, look at those colours. <gasps> Isn't that beautiful? £14.95. £48,099. Uh, absolutely incredible. One more thing to share with you before we head over to the demo area. And this is something we're talking about kicks and flicks. Kicks and flicks, kicks and flicks. Well, we're not actually. We're talking about these. Uh, we are talking out about our pearly wink flicks. And this, I love the idea of these. Very clever idea because, of course, we all love that kind of flicked paint look that you can get. But with these, you've got seven different colour options. Now, what you will actually get is um, one of the bottles. So whichever colour you choose, but you will also get your fabulous little flick stick with these. So you can see we just put one flick stick in there at the front, but you. You will get one with ever, ever color, whichever colour you go for, basically. Um, and you've got your choices of your white, your blue, your yellow, your pink, your purple, your teal or your black, which is actually called wet slate if you are choosing that as an option. And this is your flick stick within here. So, Donna, how do we work with this? What, what do we do with this? Do we fill it up? Yep, so there's a little brush in the lid if you take the lid off it. Oops, which the end the end for? Oh, that's the one. <laughs> Have a look at the colours while I just retrieve it off the floor. I'll be back in a moment. <laughs> right, I get it, I get it, I'm back. So, yeah, so um, when you get your refill, if you just give it a, a shake so all the product mixes in, um, right. and then you can actually fill that up ten times. Oh, I see, right. Yeah, so you just pop it in up, just up to the line, Got and you. then you just twist it until you see the colour coming up the nib and then you can paint with it you can flick with it um, and it's opaque as well so you can layer the colours up so it's Ooh. fantastic it works on vellum and parchment and also it's really exciting I, I like the idea <laughs> are we going to see these in action as well yes we will yeah look forward to it but to, yeah do be careful when you pull the lid off because you might lose your brush <laughs> just saying oh gosh there goes something else. Oh my goodness, it's all going on. Donna, you're going to need to save me. Um, 328117, <laughs> if you want your flick stick, of course, you've got your choice of colours with regard to these. You can go for more than one if you're wanting to, um, but if you're wanting to add those into your basket, then please do so. Um, if you missed out on some of those previous products that we've been chatting about, we have got those available for you as well. So here you go, what have we got first? Your copper infusions. Now this is your first edition. So we've got different colours to the ones that we've been featuring within the show. Different item number and £12.99, you're going to get all four of those. Again, those are ones that you're going to give them a swirl. So you've got your scarlet rose in this one. You've got your chocolate latte, you've got your beautiful sunrise, and you forget me not, that's going to be the blue one that's in there, isn't it? So 094815, just £12.99 if you want in those. Now, of course, you're going to need a good base to start with, so um, that's what Pearly Wings brought to you as well. So, got 610 GSM with these, my goodness, that is a good weight, isn't it? £9.99. So, this is your mount board, you can see it's a really good size there, so it's 19 centimetres. Or just over 19 centimetres by just.
just shy of 27 centimetres um, and at 9.99 really good value for money 367567 another way for you to get hold of the amount um, sheets is this way because within here you have got a variety of different sizes and shapes and colour tones as you can see you've got 30 pieces in toad and uh, total there should I say there so it also <laughs> poor Molly she's about to read out all the different sizes to me they're on the website we might give you the details later on but if you wanted those check out on the website or speak to our call operators with those now these ones um, again it's nice and simple one size with these but 10 repeats 900 GSM I didn't even realize there was such a thing um, a 945 578 um, nine pounds and 99 pence if you're wanting those so uh, yeah I pop those into your basket alongside any of those gorgeous elements we've been chatting about if you want in that feather stencil though it's brand new today and you have been loving it rapidly approaching 40% of the stock has gone so there you go, 631476 is the item number if you're wanting to take advantage of that. My goodness, we are busy, Donna. Very, very busy. Um, we're going to come over to you for a demo, if that's OK. Yeah. Fantastic, can't wait. You're going to have to time me, though. You're going to have to tell me because I've got... I know you like your timing. I was going to say, you? I've got three demos and I get carried away. So. OK, no problem. I'll so. try and keep you updated. <laughs> right, OK. So first of all, um, what I've done is I've primed the the blending brushes so I'm going to be using the inkies so the four colours that we, we, we do have more colours but we put these four together because you can mix them all up and it's just a nice little okay. starter set so um, what I've done is I've just literally sprayed onto the brushes in fact I'll do it with this one because I'm going to use this for something else but if you if you just spray onto it just to wet the, the bristles on your brushes and then on this one um, if I pop it down onto, always have something behind because I'll show you afterwards what we're going to do with that. Um, and just pop some onto your brush. Just literally, I'm not squeezing it hard, I'm just letting it come out. Um, and then that one. They just literally, if you did it like that, it's just one drop will come out. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then I'm just going to put um, some of the magic drops on. I can't wait to see this. So, this is a, you said this is like a blending solution to bring them together. Yeah, it just helps them blend and it also extends them. So, if I was to just use the colours on their own, um, they, they wouldn't go as far as when you put the blend in. It just helps it just bring it up. Oh, I You know, see. it goes uh, so much further with it. So, um, so I've just got some, um, I'm not sure if it's parchment or vellum that I've picked up here. Oh, um, wow. But because I've put them all together, I'll put something underneath so you can see it. Um, oh, we can see that, don't worry. Oh, can you see yeah, it? Yeah, we can see it there. Yeah, oh, yeah you can actually, effective. can't you? Yeah. Already. So, um, my goodness, look at that. So the vibrancy of them, yeah. you know, they really are concentrated. So that's all I've done with these other blending brushes. So um, I pop that to one side. Well, I'm just going to roll over and do its own thing. Um, and I am going to do something just similar to this. Okay. So I'm just literally letting the colours blend into each other because they blend so well together. Lovely. Obviously, you can use your stencil in so many different ways. Use it with your texture paste and, you know, just because Simon's done this other feather down here yeah um, nice he, he left this one so you could do your own doodling and things like that oh, as well that's so a good point. Yeah. yes we thought that was quite a nice idea so I'm using the um, the board that's actually on the show it's now really got really loads good of different ways for you to get hold of that mount board so, oh it's yeah, absolutely do, fantastic do check out on the website we'll probably bring the details up in a few moments just got a couple of technical issues with those but on the website you got your mount board in a variety of different sizes and shapes so yeah it's spoiled for choice but you'll find them all well, actually first um i've just taken some um little covers that i can put over the bits that i don't want to go over oh, like your sticky notes. yeah just little notelets on there or you can use some um, tape or something because it, it's good to just break this stencil up and just use parts of it for different things so I'm just popping them on there just so I don't catch it with a brush and um, I've, I've offset it because of the size of this board that I've cut it down um, it's not quite fitting this stencil on it's a really big stencil and all you just literally do like you would do with your ink pads and stuff actually I think I've got a little bit too much ink on that one a bit over cautious <laughs> should have oh, been oh look at that now so it this just is all gorgeous now this is using what we're using is these are the um these are the winky inkies that oh, i'm the winky using inkies, yes yeah and then um 
I'm just going to try and take a bit of this off because I think I've put a bit too much ink on, so it's going to bleed underneath the stencil, but if you don't put too much on and just go in gently. Um, and then the colours just blend so beautiful. So I've got obviously the yellow there and mm -hmm. the pink. And then if I push this up into here, you're going to get all the oranges and stuff. Of course, And obviously yes. you've got your nice sun, sunrise, sun, or oh, if you want to do it in darker colours, you've got your sunset and stuff there. So I'll just lift this a little bit up. And I know before I even lift up that it's bled underneath, but... That's okay, don't worry. Well, actually, it's well, not. Yeah, I was going to say that looks I thought okay I had because I had too much on there, but you've got your oranges in there as well. Gorgeous. And then, obviously, you can go back in. You can do it a lot darker like that. I can press hard and I know it's not bleeding <laughs> underneath. It's <laughs> okay. I was really... It. Don't I'd be you a bit worry. cautious with it. But, um, and then, when you add your other colours, obviously, you've got the nice, the nice seamless blend. Well, the colours. the purple come in now. Yeah, because they're transparent, obviously, they all... Uh, mixing lovely together. And the brushes that you're working with, are, are these uh, Pearly Wink brushes? Have you bought these to us before? We haven't actually brought them to you, no, okay. we do. We've not, we've not um, done that. That's all right, <laughs> just in case I needed to direct people to the website. Oh. That um, and then, just at the very end, I'm just going to put some of this teal at the bottom. I mean, these are blending together beautifully. And is this because really you seamless. have used that, that solution? The, it literally there. is, yeah. The magic drops so helps it blend. Oops. Did you need that bit? Um, it's all right, I've got another piece, don't worry. Okay. <laughs> so that's blended beautifully onto there. Just look as is. Look at that. I can just imagine that on a t shirt. It's love. Oh, it would look lovely on a t shirt. Wouldn't it look actually? amazing because the size of it? I mean, oh. I know, just a white t shirt. Yeah. yeah, it's huge. The whole stencil itself is A4 Oops. in size, so you can see that it's a really good size stencil. So, yeah, I mean, if, if I bring my hands into the side of it, there you can see it's a big size stencil. But, of course, with the stencil itself down at the bottom there, it's not just that large feather that you've got that Simon's designed. You've also got the smaller one. And I love that, as Donna said there, the open features in there. So you can use it to doodle. And that's exactly what's happened with this example that we've got here. And if I hold that up, you'll be able to see you've got little doodles within there because you can almost do that kind of zen doodle look or paint in there, multi-layer this so you can see that it's been used in the background and then another one has been cut out almost decoupaged on top there but I love those open areas that you've got there and then of course you've got that fabulous sentiment there again which is a good size piece there. believe in your dreams and follow your heart love that the uh, but uh, there you go I mean that that would sit perfectly isn't it if I hold that like that you can kind of get the idea that it would fit on a t-shirt wouldn't it I mean it's huge absolutely huge love it um, absolutely amazing with all the different colours in there and this is a key thing of course you can use it in lots of different ways so we've been talking about paper we've been talking about canvas but dependent on the medium that you're working with of course you could quite easily use that on your fabrics as well you just need to make sure that they're the right fabrics or the right paints the right mediums for the right occasion um, and uh, there you go you could be using that as well something I've not asked as well Donna as well anything that we're working with things like the stencils especially are we okay to make and sell with these? Yes, of course you are. Perfect. Yeah, definitely. Um, so um, these um, are all water-based. Okay. Whereas these flick sticks um, are more of a paint. Okay. And these right. are actually opaque. Right. So um, whereas like these that I've got here, which are literally just these Winky inkies that I've got. Yeah. And then what I've done here is mixed obviously the blue and the yellow together. Sorry, the blue and the pink together. And then here so the is red this and the yellow. Just together the winky inkies. Just literally the, the winky the inkies. There. Yeah. Oh, right. And then what, what you can do is um, because um, they don't stick to things like this, it's just non it's um, porous oh, surfaces. Yeah. You could transport this round and then you can just reactivate it with a little bit of water. That is brilliant. So if I take now my orange, which is just made up of the pink the and that, yeah, you can, yeah, exactly. You can pick it up and go, um, and then just do your normal blending like you would with an ink pad as well. That's clever. And obviously, you can go as dark so as you want to. You're never wasting do. anything. No, then. you're definitely not wasting anything. And what I normally say is work on onto something that you can, you know, pick up the the excess off. Um, and I'm going to do that with the techniques as well um, in the next demo, just to show you. Um, sort of different ways because honestly there's just no waste with anything use it with all your toppers and things like that as well so you can keep blending all these different colours in um, or you can um, 
I don't know where I was going with that one. That's okay. Uh, do could you know what I'm thinking of all this? With your copper infusion, I mean, could you do what you're doing with your, your copper infusion yep. on top of the pink, uh, the pearly wings? Yep. Yep, you can. They all mix so beautiful together. Not the pearly wings, the ink. <laughs> I always I know get the words mixed up. The, the inky winkies. <laughs> the winky inkies the other way around. Yeah, so, so all, the, all of the products work together nicely. They all really do re really blend nice. So I could spray some of the colours into these now. Um, this will just obviously wash out and I can put yeah. new colours in. So that's that what I wanted to show you. Lovely. And then um, the winkies. Winky Inkies will work on this. Fabulous. So this is a different type of base because we're talking like a vellum yeah. with this one. Okay. Whereas if you were to if you were to use the sprays, mm. it's not gonna be it's not gonna work as well. Mm -hmm. Whereas these are a lot more concentrated, so okay. they will. So if I just go over this now, I can't remember which side I did it on, so um oh, that's see how you nice. can yeah. you layer it all up. Oh, I didn't know I had something on the back of that one, but you can oh, see you can it underneath. Still see it, yeah. yeah, yeah, still see it coming through. Yeah, so you can do different things like that with it. And then I changed my demos around last night because when I was messing with the flicks, oh sorry, I want I wanted to carry that on because I want to get it all out and I can't get. It. I, got, I know I've not got enough time. Um, but when I was doing this one, I, I sprayed some water, flicked some water at it, and okay. then took the colour back out. That's another thing that you can do with it, which is great. Lovely. Um, with the flick sticks. So, these are all um, opaque, and when you fill them up, you just fill them up to the little line there, Lovely. and then you just want to give them a shake. Wonderful. Just to give you a little bit of a time check, we're about halfway through the show. <gasps> I need to stop this demo and go on to the next one, but I really need to show you this quickly. So, um, with, these, with the flick sticks, you just turn them and then you see the, the ink come to there. So it's kind of pushing that ink through. Yeah, oh, look at it's this. actually got a brush on it. So if you wanted to, you can just do all your doodling around the end of your, your, your page. It's, kind of like a, um, it's almost like a chisel brush that you've got with that, haven't you? Yeah, you can hear obviously it you've got your lovely oh, flicks. You can do your painting um, and stuff like that. And with this, you're choosing your colour and you're getting one of those um, flick sticks with it. So you don't flush these out, you don't change the colour. You'll have one dedicated for each of those colours as you collect them. Um, so, uh, yeah, loads of different choices with those. So if it's white, I mean, the white flicks, lots of us do like doing that. The blue, the yellow, the pink. You've also got purple, you've got your black in there as well. There's loads of uh, different colours for you to choose from. And you are choosing a concentrated colour, so it might be the teal or the purple, the pink, the yellow, blue, white entirely up to you but you will get your flick stick with that as well 14.99 which you keep as a dedicated carrier um, and uh, as you heard from Donna earlier on you can kind of top that up did you say up to 10 times yeah that? it's yeah. got 10 refills in because they're just a three mil okay um I've got that right yeah so it's a 30 yeah, uh, they're, mil they're refill 30 they're gonna mil, last so, yeah. you for ages um, and I'm just quickly showing you now because um whereas before you can't use our products on uh, black because of, because of water base, these obviously work on black, so it Look brings in that. an extra Sitting element. On the surface there. Yeah, so it's really lovely. I've had a... somebody emailing. Simon? Simon, somebody? Oh, yeah, really? Simon, Hi, Si. <laughs> I'm missing you, darling. Um, saying hello to yourself and the team. Oh. Um, he's love it, loving the show. Um, He's watching from, um, loving all the demos. You're doing a brilliant show. Um, brilliant show. You're oh, doing some perfect him. blending as well. So you're getting a big thumbs up. Oh, um, thank you, boss. And he's saying thank you to everybody <laughs> that's been loving the designs. Because, of course, it's Simon that's designed this wonderful feather that he we've been chatting has. about. So. And all these colours and everything. He's actually, he was telling me today about some other stuff that he's, um, that he's making. You've got so oh. much, because I always think back to right back in the early days. And, yeah. uh, it's not that long ago, to be honest, but you've brought us such a wide range um, since then, including things like the stencils. Yeah, and I need to move thing. on to the next one. That's okay. Oh, that's one of the well, ones I was messing with. Oh, just doodling and, and playing around with all the different pieces. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love it. Look at that, loads yeah. of different techniques. So, uh, yeah, have a play. Shall I do a little bit of yes, a recap please. and then we'll come and back to And I'll get to the next one on. Man, stencil. 
this is serious rapidly approaching 70 percent of the stock has gone my goodness it's a lovely stencil whether you are using it with all those gorgeous rainbows of colors that pearly winks bring to us whether you're going for it using things like your winky inkies whether you're going to be using your flick sticks alongside it as we saw whether you're going to be incorporating any of those copper um, infusions or your winky vibes all of those are different mediums that you could be using alongside this and of course lots of other things that you'll have in your stash as well really good size um, stencil and I love the way that you've got all the depth in there you've got a good weight of mylar um, creating these which means you can use it for things like your pastes as you can see here it's a good size perfect for your home decor perfect for fashion so as I say working on clothes you could put it onto fabric making it into bags put it onto tote bags loads of ways you can work with that but the key thing is you have to be quick it's a pop stencil and lots of you taking advantage of it already 12 pounds and 99 pence it's an a4 stencil there and because the, the kind of the, um, the the feather is off to the side it's actually a really big piece it's taking them up the most expanse of that um, a4 by going across the diagonal there so 631476 if you're wanting to get hold of that now the copper infusions my goodness they're causing a stir you're loving these now you might have got the first um, kind of release of these which we have had previously we've still got them on the website so if you want to get hold of those as well you can do but what you've got here are some brand new colors and these are lovely featuring things like your anemone blue you've got your chartreuse yellow featuring in there as well and what you've got within these I'm going to take one from the other side this time so when we actually get hold of these gotta be careful gotta be careful I don't knock anything over so this one is that magenta and you can kind of see that color that magenta tone color coming through incredibly intense colors with these so when you look at them in the bottle they look very very deep color tones so do obviously you've got the the label there that's going to give you an insight to it then you have got obviously that gorgeous gorgeous copper infusion sitting in the bottom now the idea is you give these a swirl so you're not going to shake them you don't want it to go up the tube but give it a good swirl I've literally only just started with this so you might need to do this each time you come to work with them because you've got so much within there that um, obviously you're wanting to stir up and get it right and there you go oh my goodness look at that oh wow oh gosh it's like a mermaid lagoon or something like that absolutely amazing now of course that is the case with any of those still got you've got all that gorgeousness in there so just make sure you are swirling it and then once you've swirled it you can use it in a whole host of different ways you can take it direct onto your MDF if you're wanting to so that might be one of your options that you're wanting to do with this could be that you're wanting to gesso your base so you're not using it in its entirety or dare I say wasting it you're never wasting it but you're just sometimes using more than you need to so by putting the gesso base on there you're sealing the surface and you're not having to use as much of it if you do go direct to your MDF because of course the MDF just sucks it and draws it in doesn't it here on your paper or card you can see that you can be using it spritzing it I mean you could even kind of spray this onto a little um, acetate sheet or a palette pick it up with a pen um, or maybe pick it up with a paintbrush and really have control over where you're wanting to put it or maybe you use it with a stencil now of course if you're working with the stencil and things like your mediums you'll have your texture there but of course what you can do is put your stencil back in place and then go back with those spritz of color and add that shimmer and shine on top those are your infusions they're the second edition of the sprays they're just 17 pounds and 99 pence and you are loving them 317251 as I mentioned the first edition are available I think there were four colors in that one um, but we'll show you those in a little while don't worry wink vibes now again these are your wink vibes another new today another set of fabulous colors and again the intensity of colors that you've got from these is incredible a little really does go a long way and you're going to get all of these within there so 14.99 obviously dilute them down if you want to use a pastel tone you can see there just by adding that absolutely beautiful to turn it around oh hold on I've got the right way around I thought I got it upside down for a moment then um, and again paint with it spritz through it use it in so many different ways the intensity of color that you've got from this as well amazing whether you're using it just by itself or whether you are incorporating it with some of those other bits and pieces as well so some beautiful um, examples and of course you can team them up with other elements so you can create with these and go back in with things like your copper infusion and multi-layer these to get some wonderful effects right the way through so there you go fancy getting hold of those 30 mil in each one of those five colors for just 14 pounds and 99 pence then you're in you inky I always get it wrong you're winky inkies it's me winks before me inks that's what I've got to remember 
So your Winky Inkies, again, these are brilliantly portable. You can see there you've got your different colours and as Donna did, she put them onto those kind of little brush tools that she was working with. She also used those magic drops and the magic drops extend the usability. It's not really, it's not going to dilute down the colour, but what it means is you can make it travel further, which of course means that you'll be using less. Um, £14.99, pence. we've got a fabulous price on those, where you're saving £3, so 480-099, and you can see again, amazing colours there, you're going to use those in loads of different ways. Very intense colours, those. A little really does go a long way. We saw that a few moments ago, didn't we? And then finally, those flick sticks. We quickly saw Donna working with these with her first demonstration. And these are brilliant because you're just going to choose your colour. So your colour option, it could be white if you're wanting to go for your white. You've got your blue, your yellow, your pink. You've got your teal, your purple, and you've got your black. It's actually called wet slate if you are looking for your um, black. Um, and with these ones, they are opaque colours. So again, when I um, hold up, I'm going to for the teal because you'll see with the teal there you have kind of got that color content there you've got the line there so again make sure you are giving them a good shake and of course what you're going to do with that is you're going to transfer that over to your flick stick um, and you've got enough for um, 10 refills because each time you use your flick stick you've got that brush in there which you can paint with or of course you can flick it as you can see with those examples behind there and you can refill that up to 10 times and that's purely only because you've got 30 mils within that um, kind of bottle that you've got there so it's not that it stops working or anything like that it's just you've only got the, um, the I say only 10 refills it's going to keep, keep you going for a long um, long time so 328117 if you're wanting those really good value for money and there's so many different colours to choose from you can collect those you'll find many of the other products that Pearly Winks bring to us on the website which you can add in alongside your order as well so that is the beauty if there's anything you need to stock up on if you want to check out those reviews I mean the flick sticks there we've got five star reviews use there mount board as well we saw um, obviously the mount board being used in the demonstration and here are those copper infusions your first additions with those those beautiful colors as you can see there so again why not add those in um, keep an eye on your basket though because the post and packing you might want to take advantage of freedom to avoid having to pay for any post and packing because it's part of your membership and of course you've got your seven day savers you can dip into while you're there as well so Donna back to you my dear Hello. okay um, time wise what sort of time have we got left folks we've got about 15 16 minutes or Ooh, so. right well you need to push me on because after, after this this these demos i've got the little toppers to do okay <laughs> so what are we up to so now? what i'm doing is um i've just sprayed um some of the copper infusions into um a, like a teflon type sheet oh yes yeah um, and then what i'm doing is the board if you want to have a i've left it like that so you can <laughs> have a look at it because we forgot to bring the board but it is human it's, hand just yeah it's 900 gsm oh, it's, so, it's, it's absolutely fantastic stuff so, so i'm just literally your mount board oh, now this sorry. is the one where you've kind of got your different sizes 900 gsm my goodness that is good weight isn't it it's fantastic yeah um, so the one that we've got in stock it's not the double sided it's just it's going to be a white finish that we've got so if you imagine that so yeah disregard the back i think you've got all it. all of them to be honest Oh, now the one that we've got says white on both sides. Oh, we, we do have, because we have a mixed pack. There's one with white on both sides. Right. Um, there's one with white and cream, which is this one. Right. And then there's that one as well. Oh, OK, it might be on the website then, Yeah, perhaps. have a look on the okay. website. We'll Sorry about look. that. Yeah, um, thank you. So, yeah, so I've just popped that in there, and then straight away you've got a lovely little pattern there. Um, so this is just going on to the technique. So you could just let it dry, um, use it obviously with your heat gun, just dry it off. But for time-wise, I'm just going to literally uh, pop it onto yeah, it the extra onto a, yeah, blot it just onto the tissue. But it gives you a lovely effect nice. already. Yeah. So this is just, um, sh I'm going to blast through quite a few different techniques just to obviously run through yeah, some different ways that you can use it. them. Um, but with the stencil, so I've got the stencil here and I've already, I've gone through it with gesso okay so what i'm going oh, to can just about see that design there yeah just yeah it's quite hard it. to see isn't yeah. it so yeah. what i'm going to do is i'm just going to spray over it with some of the colors okay. um so i've got the um winks here uh, sorry the wink vibe second oh, generation the wink vibes. Oh, so yeah. these are the new colors yeah so i've got do you want me to stick to one of the 
No, no, yeah. Is that all right? Forward. Could you tell me the colours of the ones that you're using? Because I can't okay. see the colours on the front here. So. <laughs> I've had to practice because I was saying them really, really wrong. And I said to Simon, could you have chosen a different colour? Oh, they didn't choose. So, I know that we've got I some. thought it was anemone blue, but I had to go on the, I had to go oh, on the thing on the telly. One. Yeah, oh, so yes. an enemy blue. And that's a flower, isn't it? Yes. Enemy, yeah. So, um, but it actually comes out like a purple colour. And that's what I said to Simon. I said, could you have been any more confusing for me? <laughs> then I've got the um, Blue Grotto, uh, which is um, part of Ooh, our heritage nice. in Malta, actually. Blue Grotto. Yeah, like so that's that. why I chose that one. Um, I've got the Magenta. Oh, wow. I've got the Sweet Orange. Lovely. And I have got the... Chartreuse, chartreuse yellow chartreuse. thank you it's, kind of, you know. it's like a greeny yellow isn't it chartreuse yeah. so i'm not going to do it all i'm just going to do little bits but just to show you that um you can use the um use things to obviously detract from it lovely okay so that's another one so the actual stencil itself if you want to just spray straight through that um then i'll find some um, oh Dropping everything everywhere. <laughs> no, it's okay. I'll just do it on this, I think. I think it should be okay on this. Now, Donna, have we got any... I know you're, you're with us for this hour. And yep. um, you are having another show this evening. But uh, have we got you back again tomorrow at all? Or, nope. You know, just tonight? Just today. Not back till um, November. Oh, okay. So... Um, I'm going to I'm going to go back to the copper infusions on this one. Okay. Um, and just do a bit of a um, rainbow type effect. So um, sweet orange. Sometimes, if you want to spray it onto something else first, just to make sure it's coming out, com you know, all straight sort of thing. Um, then I will do the chartreuse yellow next. Lovely. So this is working with the copper infusions now. Then. And enemy blue. This is not good because I can't do two things at once, so I'm having to think how to say it. Oh, that's okay, <laughs> don't worry. I've, I've, just, I've only and got the, the only colours I've got written down here is an enemy blue and chartreuse yellow, and I can't see the, the labels of the others. So I know that it was antique, wasn't it? Because that was I've the first one. The magenta there. was oh, in I've there got as blue well. Grotto as blue well. grotto. Blue grotto. That's and, the one. And you've got that gorgeous go. blue there as well. I've not got it all, but this is just a quick one. Oh wow. So it does blend really. They do even with the them. They do blend lovely. Take your excess off because we're going to use them in the next bit. Lovely. So there's no waste on it, and with it being water-based as well, it'll just wipe off. And which is a bit of a spray. Which there. is great. Is yeah. Anything left? Yeah. Yeah. Um, just get the excess off. So you can use it with all your different. Um, all your different bits and pieces, but just obviously wash it off. If you're using it with texture paste and stuff like that, that'll wash off easily as well. But just oh gosh, try yeah. and get it, try and get it, you know, clean as soon as possible. Okay, now I'm going to do a couple of quick cards. Now that stencil, just to let you know, I'm going to bring up an example um, of how it's been used. Three quarters of the stock has gone. So if you're wanting that stencil. You're going to have to be quick. We've only got one show with Donna, so we've not got a huge amount of time left during this hour. And, of course, this fabulous design created by Simon. Love the idea. Take inspiration from the large feather where you've got the infill. But then, of course, don't forget you have got the smaller feather featuring in here, which gives you that open space where you can kind of add your own doodles if you're wanting to. $12.99. It's an incredibly affordable stencil. It's an A4 size. And you've got not only the large stencil, there, you've also got that fabulous sentiment. Believe in your dreams and follow your heart. And then, of course the smaller one as well sorry for me stepping in front of the camera there but there you go those are the other elements that are featuring within that stencil as you can see there isn't that amazing love it love it love it love it love it so i can hear the heat guns going so what are you up to now donna so i'm just going to try and do a few different um toppers and um cards so okay. i've just literally sprayed onto um bubble wrap oh yeah and then just pop my card over the top of it i'm just taking off some of this excess because i want to just see if i can do a few finished Lovely. samples for you and he's still working with the copper infusion sorry yep yeah, this is copper infusion so i've used the chartreuse yellow and i've used the blue grotto on this one and when it's dry it just gives it a lovely lovely effect um just simply onto a little little card very quickly you can you know put together a card obviously you'd stick it better if you was at home and things but um 
they're just so 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 quick to make backgrounds to make batches of cards and things like that just pop a little sentiment on there I mean just like that without anything actually it's on it it's lovely, lovely yeah. but then I've just got a little flower that, oh, I'd, that I'd made and literally again just with the sprays I've just sprayed it on and then just gone over it with um, what, um, like a sealer type thing okay yeah um, and then it's just give it like a raised effect. Or something yeah, like that. that's the one. You've got a simple, really, really quick card. That's cute. I thought you had an, uh, an Australia one then. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, and then um, I'm going to stick with the colours that I've got on here. Um, what was I going to do on this one? Well, we'll just go with this one because I can't remember what I was going to do. And this is useful. Keep an eye over for your packaging and things like that. Yeah. I mean, many of us get parcels delivered and there's always some in something interesting with regards to the packaging to hang on to. Yeah, I always try and, and like use household bits for stencils and stuff because obviously you want to try and, you know, utilise things and you don't, you know, you're paying out for your, all your other stuff. So if you can do it this way, it's good. And there's some, I, I'm still finding stuff all the time what we can use them with. Well, this is it. Your imagination just gets just goes carried away, yeah, 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 yeah. But like even doing the edges of your cards and stuff like that, the really, the, I, I, in fact, I need to write down one time how many different things you can do with it all because <laughs> it's just, so, the, I'm finding stuff all the time. We've already mentioned the bubble wrap and we, we've got a fabulous example of the bubble wrap being used with some little lights as well. I mean, this is fabulous. Wraps around a jar. Just going to bring the lights down just very um, quickly, Donna. So it's going yeah, to be dark. Yeah, that's fine. I'll just carry <laughs> just on. To warn you. But have a look at that. Isn't that effective? Wrapped around a jar like that. Do like that. Obviously, battery operated um, uh, with those lights there. So don't put a real candle in there because, obviously, well, it's not going to generate a huge amount of uh, heat, but it's the naked flame, isn't it? So, yes, your little tea lights are going to be perfect within there. Donna, show us that last one that oh, you just sorry, created. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. We dipped away so from that you. was that one. See it. So that's just literally going through a little bit of um, foam. Lovely. Yeah, so use all your little household bits. Um, I've just got a stencil that's been die cut out onto a um, piece of black normal card. Oh, so this is just like a die that yeah. you made your own stencil with. Yeah, Clever. one of Tracy Hayes' little tiny cuties. Ah. Oh. So that's been uh, cut out and coloured in. Um, I'd go for a different colour this time. So we will use, let's see, the N. Oh, an enemy? An enemy blue. <laughs> so, all right. It's funny, I used to always struggle with, there's a word ephemera, and I used to always get mixed up with ephemera. You know when you've got <laughs> lots of little elements that we often see like on a, a show with vintage elements, and it's yeah. ephemera, but I used to always end up calling it something like emphysema, which is something completely different. <laughs> well, that's why I'm worrying, because it's, it's quite, quite <laughs> similar to something else. And I, I always get mixed up with my vinaigrettes and my vignettes as well. That's another <laughs> one that I trip up on. So then this one, I've gone for a multicoloured one and then take Ooh, that off like and then that. that's like left a lovely background on there. I'm just going to dab some of the excess off. Lovely. Again, if you can just leave it to dry naturally, mm -hmm. um, then do that. Wonderful. Just to give you another time check, Donna, we've got about eight minutes left. <gasps> right, okay. So I'm going to get some of this colour on here. I'm going to have to change um, techniques and stuff just so I can get some more techniques done and show you. But um, you fitted Let so me fit much this into one in. this little hour. Oh, you wouldn't. There's so, so many today. Now, of course, we, we can follow you guys through social media. And I know you do loads of yes, kind of tutorials and videos do. and things like that. So do we just simply look for you as Pearly Winks? Yep, Pearly Winks, you can find us. Um, we've actually got a, a shop in Bolton now. Have, uh, yeah. Sorry, it's in Ratcliffe now. We've moved to oh. Ratcliffe. Yeah, so um, it's doing really, really well. Oh, that's good to know. Yeah. Now, those copper infusions, folks, you've been loving those. You really have. 70% of the stock has gone. These are the second edition. Um, the first ones flew out. You, I think they sold out probably about three times, I think Donna said with these. But these are your new colours there. The magenta one that I've just slightly kind of put on the counter there in the wrong position. I better put that right, haven't I? I was just frightened, frightened that I didn't. I, I thought it was going to fall off, isn't it? So I'm going to be really careful. And then step away, step away. Uh, right, there you go. So you've got your magnolia in there, you've got your sweet orange, you've got that chartreuse yellow, you've got that blue, uh, blue grotto in there, I mean, it's gorgeous. Um, and then you've also got, no, I can't read that one there, that we've got a blue there as well. Oh, the anemone blue. And then your antique as well. Can I dip in and kind of give another one a swirl? Because I really enjoy giving them a swirl. Which one's this one? We have got, oh, this one is the uh, blue grotto. Um, so again, when you get them to actively
about that gorgeous copper tone, you need to give them a good swirl. So swirly, 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 because you don't want to shake it because you don't want it to go up through the tube and through the nozzle. But then, oh my goodness, can you see that? Swirling around. You see there's more, more swirling than needs to be done. But of course, we want to get back to the demo. Donna's got her die cutting machine out. She's going to be showing you more techniques with these. But these are proving to be, inc oh, look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at that, and that one is your blue grotto. £17.99 will get you all of those on their way to you. I'm going to put it back in a minute. Um, yeah, that one's going to go in that gap there. I'm not going to put it in just yet because I'm going to knock everything over. But we're going to go back over to Donna um, for the rest of the show. They'll show you some more techniques with these. Over to you, Donna. Hello. <laughs> so, um, I always say to you, so like all your overspray and stuff like that, keep it. So, um, I'm just going to do a couple of little bits of that, show you yeah, die cuts no and things problem. like that. So, so these are using all of the products that we've got on the show really then? Yeah, so, okay. so all the different colours, so you can make loads of toppers and, and you know, just, well, just loads of stuff. It's, it's I don't know, it just goes on and on and on, but like, <laughs> say for instance, like these that I've just been spraying up by just doing a quick, very quick background. Um, this is the, the board, the blackboard that we're oh, talking about right, that you've yes, made yeah, board, already. Yeah. Some lovely little toppers just by literally cutting them down. How quickly is that? Oh, that looks adorable. It's cute, isn't it? And then a yeah. little word on there, or do it, you know, do it the opposite way around yeah. or whatever. Or carry on, you know, um, doing other stuff on them, little bits of writing and things like that. Lovely. They make really, really good toppers. So um, keep all that sort of stuff um, and make all your different toppers. Once you've um, made them like this, you can carry on and then do more, do a bit of writing or a bit of etching and stuff like that on there. Lovely. And they just make great toppers well, for your cards. you can see that one that you've got there, you've got that copper, the yeah, copper that coming the copper, through on it. Yeah, really yeah, yeah. it's up. really strong yeah. on there, yeah. Um, again, with all your die cuts and things like that, you, you know, you can make frames and all you know, all that good stuff, little bit words and things, they can all go onto your card. Um, the kitchen roll. Okay. So this, these are all the, the colours oh, that I've been spraying. Yeah. So literally your mop-ups, keep oh, all your mop-ups. Is it coming <gasps> through? Yeah. You see that there? Wow. So um, obviously all that product is on there, so you're not wasting it. Yes, so if yeah. I just take one of the dies out of here, just simply one of the frames or something like that, yeah. and then pop that into here. Wonderful. In fact, I'll, do a, I'll just do a couple while I've got them. This now those copper infusion rapidly approaching 80% of the stock has gone. Um, if you are watching on repeat, I hope you've managed to get hold of these. If you're watching live in the studio, we're just coming up to, um, or just um, 10 to um, 8 in the evening, um, and we have still got stock available of those. In fact, we've got stock available of everything, but it's all kind of very, very busy and hanging on by a thread. But if you want your second edition copper um, infusions to follow with the first edition, $17.99. The stencil, busy for the stencil as well. Um, and of course, we are busy for the first edition sprays, which are at the bottom of the screen as well. Now, with your second edition, you've got your six sprays. But then, when you do come in for your four, um, or your six, sorry, your first, uh, oh no, these ones are the second ones. They're very, very persistent. They want their TV limelight, don't they? They keep popping back up on the screen. I think the, I think the set of four doesn't want to play, so they're on the website. But those were the first, um, first release of those ones. How are you doing there, Donny? You yeah, can take so, your frames. Yep, yeah, so you've got beautiful little frames that obviously then you can use in, in your work. If you did the other colours as well, then interchange them and things like yeah. that. You've got all your words. Oh, I, I mean, just like your letters and everything. Yeah, just yeah. like that on its own is a lovely little topper for your card, things like that. So is that cut out of the kitchen roll? That's again? literally this, yeah, this, this one that I've just wow. cut up. And do the same with like all it's your like mock-up boards. Yep. Yeah. So I can't get that out of there quick enough. Um, but the same with all your mop-up boards and things like that. They make lovely toppers. So there's just no waste whatsoever. I was just looking for one of those. Oh, there, I've got one there. So these ones are just ones that I've done previously. So I just these. very, very quickly. Hey? I'm going to say by all means talk. Oh, I don't know how long I've got. I'm like, oh. <laughs> so yeah, so these are like mop-up boards. Or if it goes like this one, for instance, this would be something that I've had down, sprayed around it and things like that. And you think, oh, I'm not going to do anything with yeah. that. Well, some people might use it as a journal page. But if you don't like it um, as a journal page, just pop it through on your die cutting machine. Or if, if you've got a thin card and things like that, you can use it um, 
you know, with, if you've got punches, maybe you don't have a die cutting point, machine, yeah. or literally just cut strips or out. Or even just slice it, like yeah. you say, with your oh, guillotine or something like that. That didn't sound right, did it? I think it's just, they just make noises, don't they, the die cutting machines, when you pop them through. So usually, if there's a resistance, if it feels it's not going through, then that's when to stop. But you'll probably find that you will get a cracking with it. Oh, yeah, it's okay. that noise. There you go. That's oh. okay. All right, don't worry. <laughs> it really didn't sound right. It can be quite scary when you hear that noise, but if you can't get it through the machine, that's that, that's kind of warning you. But the fact that you did manage, we're down to the last forty-five seconds of the hour. Oh. Um, I mean, Donna, you have been working like a good and during this hour to show us all those different ways you can work with these. Um, don't forget, if you hard, have but... just joined us, do go back and watch on Rewind. Donna's been showing us some amazing techniques using all the fabulous products that per Pearly Winks bring to us. And of course, the star or one of the star of the hour has been that fabulous stencil that Simon has created for us, which is still available at $12.99. Also, those fabulous copper infusions, you have been loving those as well. So if you're wanting those, these are the second generation, the first generation are available on the website. And of course, all those Wink vibes as well. Donna, thank you, thank you. so much. Can I just very, very quickly say... Hello to my 